This is Michelle Sullivan reporting from Vancouver. I'm at the Alzheimer's Association International Conference. So, Dr. Creo, what is your opinion about the new, the two studies on the medical foods? Right. I think certainly the Souvenir 2 results um, are exciting to see. We do know that uh, nutrition is important in general and nutrition is important for brain health. Uh, it's exciting to see a medical food company um, actually following a fairly rigorous way to demonstrate efficacy. Uh, we know that a lot of other medical foods don't, don't do that and, and just go straight to market without enough evidence. Um, so we have been very interested in following this particular story because they can continue to uh, demonstrate uh, the need for efficacy in their studies, in their trial design. And the cytocholine? Um, the cytocholine trial is it, very interesting because it's uh, gonna, repurposing it for something a little bit different uh, in, in terms of symptomatic treatment for Alzheimer's disease. Um, so we certainly know that it's uh, fairly safe and it works in other diseases. Uh, and it's nice to see that uh, we have options out there for symptomatic benefit in clinical trials uh, for Alzheimer's disease that come from repurposing our drugs. Uh, so these are great examples of, I think, the variety of approaches uh, that we are pursuing in Alzheimer's disease and that we need. We we know that Alzheimer's disease is not a, a one uh, cause disease, it's a heterogeneous disease. And so we are going to need multiple approaches. We're going to need multiple therapeutics, probably used at multiple times during the disease uh, course.